In this video, I want to reveal exactly how to make $100 per day with affiliate marketing. But there is a catch. We're only going to discuss a strategy that involves building a sustainable, long-term, real online business. And in fact, I use this strategy to make $100 a day up to $1,000 per day. And I've even made $100,000 per month. So before we jump into the strategy, we want to just reverse engineer some of the numbers that are behind a hundred dollars per day from affiliate marketing. And I actually want to highlight just a few problems that I've seen with some other videos on this topic. So things to watch out for when you're watching videos about this, uh, or at least that I kind of think about that might not be the best strategies um, moving forward when you're trying to make money online. And I see a lot of them talk about uh, a business that you can't scale and you can't earn passive income from. So when you're building an online business, you really want to start one that you can scale up. So when you reach $100 per day, you want to be able to scale that to you know $200, $500, and so on. And one that's going to give you passive income. So many times, you know, there are some videos out there, they show you how to make $100 per day, but then what happens tomorrow with your business and your tactics that you're using for uh, that particular strategy. Sometimes, you know, they aren't there and you always have to be there hustling and clicking, copying, pasting all the time. So with this strategy that I want to share, you're going to make $100, but then the next day you're going to make $100, the next day you're going to make $100 and so on. So whether you log in to your website, check your emails or not, you've built that point up to where you're making $100 per day and your website is up and running and it's passive income to a certain extent. So that's really, really uh, important. Many videos, they talk about, you know, getting on this whole trending topics and viral videos, reposting viral videos. I don't think that's a recommendation or that's not a recommendation I would personally make to someone if they wanted to start an online business and make some real uh, money. If all these videos that you watch, they tell you to go to ClickBank, and just grab an affiliate link and share it on social media. There's a bit more to building a real business than that. And then there's also some videos that sort of talk about buying advertising. That certainly works, but it's very difficult for a beginner to go and spend $300 in ads and then make $400 back. So you're you're making a $100 profit there. Um, You might do that once, but then tomorrow, are you going to be able to uh, do that again? Are your ads going to work and so to speak. So it's, it's a little more difficult than just, you know, spending a hundred dollars and hopefully earning back 200. Um, so again, this video, it's not about shortcuts, instant gratification. It's usually not a good thing in terms of long-term results with an online business. So we're not going to talk about, you know, using TikTok, Pinterest, or Instagram. You can certainly use social media with the strategy we're going to cover here, but it's not the foundation of this business strategy. So We will talk about that, but now let's kind of get into the numbers so you can see some actual math behind, you know, what it takes to make a hundred dollars per day with affiliate marketing. So I'm going to just, just highlight this and we can move over to the whiteboard for sort of easy viewing. Okay. So we want to first talk about this concept called or this definition called earnings per click. So earnings per click is called EPC. And what it is, it's an average earnings report. So it's a metric that is commonly used in affiliate marketing. And basically it takes into account the clicks that you get and then your earnings uh, afterwards. So you might get you know 99 clicks on one of your affiliate links and then the 100th click, you actually earned a sale and maybe you earned $100. So that would mean that for 100 clicks, you earned $100. So your earnings per click is $1. So you you didn't wait, make $1 for every click, but on average, that's what you get when you take your earnings divided by how many clicks that you got. So for one of my past businesses in the shaving niche, I looked at my Amazon associates sort of average earnings per click over a time period, and it was 15 cents. So on average, I got 15 cents every time someone clicked on a link on my website and they were redirected to Amazon. So next question you need to ask yourself with an earnings per click of 15 cents is how much traffic do you need to earn $100 or how much traffic per day, excuse me, how much traffic do you need to earn uh, 
how many clicks do you need to earn to get $100 per day? So if you were to times 666 times 0.15, that's going to give you $100 per day. So you need to get 666 clicks on your affiliate links with an earnings per click of 15 cents on average to earn $100 per day. So next you want to ask yourself, how much traffic so how many website visitors or you know traffic from social media do you need to get those 666 clicks in order to get $100? Well, here is where we need to make an assumption and we're going to assume that our 20% is going to be our click through rate. So perhaps, you know, 100 people come and view your website, 20 of them will click on your affiliate link and go to the affiliate program that you're recommending. So in order to get 666 clicks with a click through rate of just 20%, we need 3,330 targeted visitors to our website. So I want to further this example with throwing in a few other numbers here and we'll just slide this over here. So here are some numbers and some actual stats behind some products. And we're going to keep this theme of 3,330 targeted visitors with this many clicks. And this is our EPC. Okay, so again, this is actual sort of real data from one of my past um, websites in the shaving niche. So in a Braun, elect a Braun electric shaver, it costs about $150. So if you go to Amazon, the Braun Series 7, that's a popular electric shaver I used to recommend in the past. Right now it's uh, selling for $150 on Amazon. So if we assume our Amazon commission is 5%, we sell one electric shaver and you get $7.50. So $150 with a times 0.05, it's going to give you $7.50. So if we send someone from our website, from our affiliate links, they go to Amazon and they purchase the Bronze Series 7 for $150 with a 5% commission rate, we get $7.50. So after we're going to assume in this example that after a thousand clicks on our affiliate links, let's say we sell 20 shavers and that's going to give us $150. So 20 shavers that we sell, for $7.50, we earned $150 and it took us a thousand clicks. So our conversion rate here is 2%. So a thousand clicks, 20 sold, that's 2%. And we earned $150. So our earnings per click is 15 cents. So that's how we got the earnings per click here of 15 cents uh, in our previous example that we were discussing here. So now you need to ask yourself, you know, how can you build an online business that targets and gets 3000 over 3000 daily searches per day looking for electric shavers? Well, we can go to a keyword research tool called Ahrefs. And if we plug in the keyword electric shaver, you can see that the global search volume. So this is, you know, how many times that search for on a, like an estimation around the globe, it's almost 40,000 searches uh, a month for just that keyword. And then there's many other keywords, best electric shaver, electric shavers for men and so on. So here you can see how much volume there is. And if we actually opened up another one and here is best electric shaver for men. So a more long tail keyword that gets a search volume globally of 11,000. So every month that's searched for about 11,000 times on Google and for just the best electric shaver for men. Again, you've got best electric shaver for sensitive skin, uh, best electric um, shaver for thick beards and so on. But if we just scroll down and we looked at one of the websites that's ranking for that, we'll open it up in the new tab and I have it open there. It's shavercheck.com. So here's the article that's ranking number one for that best electric shaver for men. And if we scroll down, they you know review electric shavers, they give us uh, some of their thoughts on them, they review them. Uh, they help you choose them. And if we go to, you know, where they have an affiliate link, here we have the best men's electric shavers. They recommend the Bronze Series set a nine. So if we see the price on Amazon and we click and we actually go and purchase one of these, they will get 
commission. They will get a commission. So these electric shavers are actually much more expensive than $150. These are $300. So this particular website is doing affiliate marketing with Amazon. They are reviewing electric shavers uh, and they are going and they're earning commission. So this electric shaver website, shavercheck.com, just a random one we found. These are the type of businesses that you can build because they are uh, duplicatable in terms of you know, just an individual running this. You don't need um, a big editorial team or anything. A one person uh, can definitely build this. And if we actually go and do an overview look at this particular website, we can see that this tool is is estimating that the, sh uh, the traffic value is almost, it's over $100,000 per month. So these guys are earning well over $100 per day uh, based on these estimates. Uh, they're not always exact. If we dived in and just looked at this one page that's ranking, Ahrefs is, rec is estimating that this page alone gets something like 1,500 searches every single day. So back to our view uh, and our first sort of uh, estimation there, you know, can this particular website uh, gain, you know, enough to make $100 per day? Uh, I would assume that they're getting well over 3,000 targeted visitors. Uh, they're earning much more than $100 per day. This tool is, is estimating that they are earning much more. And this is a business you know, that you can build. It's a business that is a niche website. It's an authority in this topic, electric shavers, uh, and it's ranking well on Google and it's solving people's problems. People wanna know what the best electric shaver is. They want to find out which one gives the closest shave. They want to compare Panasonic versus Braun and so on. So this particular person building this website, something that you can definitely do, and they're earning well over $100. And it's a legitimate business that is earning $100 every day, whether this person logs in you know, and posts new, contact, new content, checks their email. It's an established business that is up and running and doing very well, earning well over $100. So that's just one sort of example. So if we sort of come to our table and, you know, that is one in that particular niche, you might think, you know, you don't know anything about electric shavers and, you know, you want to see a few examples with some other type of niches. So I've got another niche that I personally was uh, involved with. This is the uh, guitar lesson niche. So we'll just do the same thing here. Uh, and just another example where you can sort of see how the numbers will change based on the different uh, niche that you might be in. So for this particular niche, the earnings per click is much higher than 15 cents. We're talking $3. So the product that we're recommending is a guitar lesson website called uh, Guitar Trick. So if you had a website all about the guitar, uh, you used to play guitar, you checked out the lessons, you reviewed them, and you recommend that your visitors go and they sign up for Guitar Tricks uh, program. They can try it, uh, try it for free. They do a free trial. Then they start um, buying their lessons. Then you will receive a commission when they sign up for uh, their lessons. And for this particular um, affiliate offer, the earnings per click was $3. So it's much, much higher. So to earn $100 per day, you just need 33 clicks. So how much traffic do you need to earn 33 clicks? Well, we assumed that our click through rate was 20%. So you need 165 targeted visitors per day in the guitar lesson niche in order to earn $100 per day. That is something that you can totally, totally do with a niche website that ranks well on Google if you become the authority on online guitar lessons. And just to break down the math a little bit more, these are, you know, the actual data from a website um, that I was involved with. And we can just see how this example works through this sort of data. So one guitar lesson usually uh, paid a $25 commission. So when you send someone from your website to Guitar Tricks and they sign up for their online lessons, you get $25. So after 33 clicks, you might register four signups, and that is one way to get $100. So that's one way to get to this earnings per click of $3. So your conversion rate there is 12%. So if 100 people come to your website all about online guitar lessons, you're the friendly expert, you're the authority, 12 might click through your affiliate links and actually make a purchase. And this is how you get to an earnings per click of $3 
for this particular offer. So you need less traffic uh, with this particular affiliate program as opposed to uh, selling an electric shaver through Amazon. And if we actually went over to you know the uh, Ahrefs, the tool again, and we wanted to sort of look at you know how hard would it be to get 165 targeted visitors because that's what the math on this particular ant, uh, this particular example gave us. We need 165 you know, targeted visitors uh, per day. And we looked at, you know, online guitar lessons. Uh, it gets at 11,000 searches every month. And if we went and we, you know, niched our niche down a little bit further or got a little bit more long tail, the best online guitar lessons, 4,000 searches every single month. And again, there's other variations of that keyword. And we just kind of looked through some of the results here. And there's a website, Hello Music Theory. So hellomusictheory.com. 12 of the best online guitar lessons and courses in 2023. So again, this is a website, a niche website about music theory and their number one recommendation is guitar tricks. So if we click on this link, we're going to be taking two guitar tricks and we sign up uh, for these lessons. This website will earn $25. So again, this website uh, is something, again, you can totally build a legitimate business informational website about online music theory and it recommends you know guitar lessons probably piano lessons singing lessons and so on and if we just did an overview of uh, this particular website in this tool you know it's estimated search va value based on the keywords that it is ranking for is over it's one hundred sixty nine thousand dollars per month so again those are just estimates but this website is definitely making a hundred dollars per day and it's definitely one that you can uh, replicate as well. And you might think, you know, shavers isn't something I'm interested in or music lessons is not something I'm interested in. I've got a PDF that you can get access to below this video that discusses 287 profitable niches and all of them will have some sort of pattern that like we just looked at. So there's going to have an earnings per click uh, and, you know, you'll need a target of traffic to uh, get to your website and, and have your links that go to various uh, products that within these niches. So, you know, mixed martial arts, you've got CrossFit, you can be an affiliate for um, down in the wealth category. You can, you know, there's a lot of cryptocurrency exchanges that you might want to uh, build a website all about cryptocurrency and people sign up for exchanges and you can earn affiliate dollars like that. So the point is that, you know, getting it to hundred dollars a day, uh, it's definitely doable. Uh, but you do need a good strategy so you can get to $100, you can earn that today, you can earn that tomorrow, and you can continually grow your uh, business through uh, a strategy that does offer some passive income stream as well. So you might be wondering, you know, how do you make a website like this one, you know, shavercheck.com? Well, you do it with uh, some sort of system. And I have a seven step system. And I actually have a free course that runs through how this works. And you can find links to that below this video. But I'll just show you quickly here in this slide. Uh, basically, you know, the step one is to know your business model. So that is affiliate marketing. So you probably know how affiliate marketing works, you make product recommendations. If you're shown to be the one that referred someone to a product or service, you get a commission. Uh, just like that website sent someone to Amazon. If they buy that shaver, that website earns a commission on that purchase. So you know what affiliate marketing is. Next is to choose your platform. So in these examples, we talked about niche websites, websites that rank well on Google. Everyone goes to Google. It's the most visited website in the world. They search for problems. If you can offer solutions to their problems and make product recommendations, you will earn commissions. And it's a great platform to start with. And then you can venture off to TikTok and social media if that makes sense. So that would be my recommendation to do a theme-based niche website. Then you choose your niche. So there's various ways to do that. I'll include some other videos below this one to help you find your niche. Then you find keywords. So like best electric shaver, best electric shaver for men, best electric shaver for coarse hair, electric shaver for sensitive skin, you know, Norelco shaver versus bronze shaver and so on. So there's so many keywords that you can go after and target. Then you build your website and you build your content around your keywords and you optimize them and you rank on Google and you are the friendly expert that is uh, a, an authority uh, and a recommended source on your particular topic. And when people find your website and thousands of people find this particular website every single day, they will listen to this website's reviews and recommendations. You'll go to Amazon, they'll make purchases and this website will make a commission. So that's a really, really good strategy for doing affiliate marketing and it's one that could get you to $100 per day and well above. So I hope that you found this video useful. 
below, I will include a link to a course that talks more about this and some other uh, videos that talk more about this strategy and particularly about how to choose your niche because that is a common problem among beginners. So I hope you found it useful and I will see you in the next video.